What's up you guys? I decided to um, get rid of the old digital camo paint job I had on my XDM and I just got tired of it so I am planning on doing a uh, flat dark earth or it's actually called dark earth from Bat Brownells. It's a uh, aerosol can with a uh, epoxy paint. So if this is actually what kind of crap quality but that's what it used to look like before. It's a digital camo, digital camo um, mirage flage, whatever. That was from Laru, Laru Weaponry. I can't speak today, but I just got tired of it, so I decided to send it all off. Um, strip the inside, everything except for the. Uh, Magazine magazine release because the getting that uh, spring back in is kind of a pain in the butt to actually get back in. So I just left it in. Took out the uh, the button. I also uh, took out all the texture right here that was that um, a lot of the XDMs uh, have. I felt just I just just didn't like it. it. Felt too big. So I like how how it uh, feels right now. It's nice and. Uh, Smaller feels a lot smaller with the uh, number one interchangeable back strap. So um, I used it with a twenty dollar Dremel from Walmart, which I was surprised. I thought they'd be around thirty forty bucks, but that's also cordless. So um, also some people have XDMs on right here. It's all gone, but there's usually a lip right here. I decide to grind it off because it just didn't feel comfortable so now it feels all good I'm thinking of stippling the uh, grip right here probably go with some kind of divot because it feels pretty good but um I did it on my old AR hand grip and it's all the different textures I did there's the divot there's a bark so basically what I'm going to do is, when I get the paint, I'm going to paint this first, uh, three coats, just to see how, if the if I can still feel the texture with the, with the epoxy paint on it, so, uh, that's, that's what I'm going to have to do first before I actually decide on my final decision for a, uh, specific texture. Um, I textured it with this, uh, soldering iron, which is actually meant for melting stuff or glass windows. I don't know, I just got it at Hobby Lobby for 26, or not 26, 16 dollars. Comes with the uh, flathead. So, but that's that's all I'm doing right now with all my guns. I, um, I decided to email Rock River Arms because they, they've taken forever on my uh, scope mount so I decide well, I haven't gotten a response because it's, it's pretty late but I emailed them I told them just cancel my order and you know, I've been waiting so long so I told them cancel it hopefully they'll cancel it because I already ordered a uh, Burris PEPR scope mount from Midway and should be here on Friday so but uh, that's about it um oh you know, get back. Probably post the video next week. Show you guys the uh, finish and XDM9, and hopefully, I got the I'll get the scope mount. So, all right, thanks.